There we go, there's a face. Hello everyone, face here. Welcome to uh What day is it? Wednesday. Wednesday stream. Quarantine is ruining me. And also I uh, woke up from a nap not more than 20 minutes ago. So I'm still kind of groggy. So please forgive. Uh we will catch in. Oh my goodness, look who's popping into chat. It would be none other than Sabrina. Hello. How are you doing, Dad. friend? And pancake. All my friends pumping in. How is all your lovely faces on this Wednesday? Sorry, I'm getting connected. Although, proud of me, I did bring something to drink. I got my tea brewing in the background. Um, so a couple of things. Turns out it's not my CPU fan that's stupid annoying. So I got to take out my computer report again to try to figure out what which of the fans decides to go all haywire on me uh, occasionally. Um, so that's going to be fun. Um, what else is new? Um, oh, I need to switch my... Okay, Animal Crossing profile is up. That's, by the way, that's what we're going to be playing. We're going to be playing some Animal Crossing. Um, if you guys want, you are more than welcome to friend me up. Uh, I think this is the command to go ahead and do that. Hold on a minute. I'm catching up on chat. Ooh, we got some delicious food. Made some spaghetti with meat sauce and Italian sausage. Yum. I had a, I had fish sticks earlier. And you know what dawned on me? So, you know how tomato is a fruit, right? This is going to probably, you're going to hate it. But tomato's a fruit. And, um, that would make ketchup a jam or a jelly. And I hate it. And, uh, that has been stuck in my head for a few days. Let's see, let's see. Your family thought you had corona. Oh, goodness. Oh, man, strep throat is a terrible thing to have right now. Yeah, people could think you have the corona. It took forever to get antibiotics. Yep, I can understand that. Uh, are you still sick? Are you still sick right now? Are you feeling any better? What am I forgetting, guys? Oh, I need to switch my screen. That would be what I want to do. Uh, this button. There, got it. I can do things. Um. Also, oh, my thing closed right as I try to log in. Also, I'm thinking about doing a a D and D campaign online. Cookie time. So if you guys are interested in doing that, um, you can do exc exclamation point D and D, uh, and there'll be information there. Um, it's in the it's in the Discord as well. Or. It'll tell you about it, but I should put I should have put the Discord link in the message. I'll do that next time. Um, but essentially, yeah, I'm, it's something that I've been mulling in my head because the quarantine would be perfect for it. However, apparently there's a ton of interest for it. Um, the couple people I've talked to offline, so I don't know how ne we would necessarily handle that because once you get beyond a certain number of players, it doesn't matter. It's either they're going to raffle stomp everything, or if you try to make it difficult, that whatever is that difficult is going to raffle stomp your players. So, um, I don't know. It could be something interesting, so keep that in mind if you guys are interested in. But we are going to be playing some more heckin' Animal Crossing. This is day two. My tea is back there. I got to remember that. Man, I'm tired. My alarm went off for a stream, and I was like, no. I was mid-rim. Testing, testing, testing. Hello! Oh, shit. Oh, dear. Uh, so sorry about that. I forgot his voice. The volume was a little loud there. Something like that. Hello, everyone. I think that's it. Starting today, I'll be doing an island-wide broadcast full of island updates going on and such. Hmm? I'll go over some things that are very important in island life, so lend me your e island ears for a short time. Now... It's only fitting that we kick off this daily ritual with a doozy of an island announcement. The Kronktown Airport is now open for business. Hell yeah. Also, it's funny because I play at night. <laughs> Maybe I should change the time on my Switch. It's kind of depressing. I wish coming in at night. <laughs> you can use cough drops. Now it feels a little scratchy. Oh, that's good. Or your bard fucks it all up. I'm... Well, see, I'm okay with those kind of gameplays where, like, I gotta, as a DM, I have to play on my feet. I'm totally okay with that. I don't like the, oh, oh, like, if they get into combat where they can't hit the character, the creature, but if I make it 
any easier, they raffle stomp everything. That that's no fun. I like the thinking on my feet feet part. Wait, the mod didn't do the treat command. Is the bot disconnected again? I checked that. It's connected. Wait a minute. I heard it. Did I just forget to give him treats? The dogs heard it, guys. The dogs heard the treats. That's why you were sitting there. Stay here. Thank you for the treaties. Also, you know what? Their um, their bed is upstairs. I'm gonna have to run and get that real quick. Please hold. I can't have them. Can't have you laying on the cap the carpets. How rude! I took this couch up or their bed upstairs earlier, uh, because I was doing work from home, and uh, they were sitting on the couch and they looked sad, so they were able to sit next to me. Let's go get your your bed. Inky doggy, Inky doggy, here you go, blankets and pillows. There you go. Love you. Crunk Town Airport is open for business. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um. You just want to have a sing Jessica and sing a top coin or toss a coin to your Witcher? That's funny. They are smart. They can be they can be dumpy, but they are actually pretty smart. Well, Jada is. Mama's is kind of dumb. Huh. But I love you. Um, let's see. Yeah, I have a... I started a whole new channel in the Discord for, uh, specifically related to Dungeons & Dragons. And uh, uploaded a bunch of tools and stuff that I've collected. Over the... Ow, oh, okay, that's not ready. Ha! Ah. And, uh, I posted those, so if any of you guys do a D&D campaign, you have the links and you're free to use them. Alright, tea is not ready yet. Lark away, my friend! Alright, I don't need a keyboard. I need... This. Starting today, you can use online or local communication to fly in other islands for a visit. That's not all. Oh, no, no. The airport counter now offers postal services. I can send mails. And just like the resident services center, the airport is open 24 hours a day. So please do drop by for a look. Oh, I do have one other item to share. And it, too, is a whopper, hmm? As of this very day, a brilliant fellow by the name of Blathers will join us in Cronk Town. Mathers has a keen interest in biology. Past and president, and he's here to study Crunkdown. I have so many things to give him. I sincerely hope everyone lends their cooperation. Inquisitive residents should stop by his tent for details. That's all for me. I do hope you enjoy another fine day in the luxurious Crunkdown living. Freaking bugs. Excuse me. Okay. I'm ready for another nap. How come the... Why is the dog cam sideways? Hold on a minute. The dog cam is sideways, guys. Wait, is it? No, it just looks sideways. Why does it look sideways? I am... So very confused. It's because the blanket is throwing me off. Okay, that's better. Jeez. I'm tired. Holy crap. Oh, something's bloop blooping. I got a miles. Oh, do these refresh every day? No. Wait. It wants me to plant flowers again. All right, I need to go buy flowers. Oh, here you go. Dream house. Oh, yeah. I built a home. I'm going to have to check it out. Loner. That's sad. Although, it me. Hold on. Turn up the music. All right. I got a message. From Happy Home Academy. Greetings from the Happy Home Academy. Our goal, we want to help... You make your home the best that it can be. Look for 
Four messages from us as you hone your home decorating skills. A heartwarming gift is attached. Sweet. My pockets are full. Fuck. All right, hold on. We'll do that in a minute. We got it. Oh, look at that pretty butterfly. Fuck. Yo, that butterfly is pretty and my ha hands are full. Uh, fuck. There's that bug moth. Where, where did we put, we put him down here. Yo, take my stuff. Whoa, bug. Fuck. There's all these bugs around. And the only bug we're guaranteed on get, he's an owl, is uh, that one outside of the tent. Hey, hi, I like your tie. He said that as, or he pointed it as I said that. Hi, pleasure to meet you. My name is Brothers. I'm extremely interested in the of this island. As I have come to conduct research, if you will. Oh, oh. 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 the person, a personage, personage. Fuck, I can't speak. Which was the location for this tent? I am. Yes, you have a genie. 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 Yes, Oh, I can pass. There is one smallest problem regarding said museum. That is, I have to be able to secure permission to open a museum proper. Empty display cases will not do. I told, I'm told. Display cases with something to display. That is another matter. Which is where you come in. A bot. Allow me to explain. You see, there is not only insects and fish I plan to display in my esteemed institution, institution but fossils too. Yuri, right, what's going on, my dude? Yeah, look at that owl friend, right? This primitive plant is flesh with feathers. Fossils, I require. Whatever you say, I can't just hop over it, you say. Oh, see you, I have a solution. Dishes is trying to populate an entirely deserted island. We got treats coming out from Yuri. What's going on, my dude? You think it for treaties? I got your message right as I woke up right before stream. <laughs> Sorry, man. A kind gesture. Also, more puppy pity bitties. Um. Want some more bitties? I think it for the five bitties. Yum, 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 yum. I wonder if my tea is done. Yeah, you see? With the good together from Crown Town, you can make a lengthy vaulting pole. Vaulting pole. Is that uh, akin to a stripper bowl? This pole can be used to propel oneself across the river. Up and over you go. Who do you? I send DIY schematics for a shovel to be dig fossils from the ground as well. Which brings me to my point. Please, 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 Ooh. Make a donation. Marvelous. What would you like to donate? This guy, a sea bass. Here you go. Oh, -ho -ho. This must be a sea bass. Now, might I interest in a few fascinating facts about your sea bass? Yeah. Wonderful. I would love nothing more. Sea bass is a name given to a variety of different species of saltwater fish. I have very bunch with some as small as four inches and some as staggeringly ginormous as eight feet. Oh, it's like, look at me learning in this game. Sea bass is a bit pedestrian, though. Many species have better names, such as red banded perch. What a delightfully whimsical dusky grouper. Can I catch one of those? But the potato card. Oh no, I think of the pink mamo. Or is that Mao? Momo? I don't know how to pronounce that. Oh, now you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? 
Bravo, thank you. Once the museum is completed, it should be displayed with the utmost dignity. Where are you keeping all these then? What's the matter? I wonder if you have anything else in the door. And if so, I did take it for you. I do got something. Marvelous. What would you like to donate? Oh, I could have gotten rid of a freaking moth. I didn't know I had so many. God dang it. Here's a moth. Eek! A moth! Oh, he has mothophobia. I know so many people that have that. Oh, the repugnance! Good heavens, I must make a composure. Uh, 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 I beg your pardon. Bugs, I do detest them. And you're collecting them? As much as I can tell you about this is it, you apprehended. If you insist, that is. Sorry, you gotta tell me. Oh, I see. In that case, uh, um, anything more than not a creature. Alas, no. He's fine for flattering beasts. I've been known to hunt the daylight at twilight hours too. He really doesn't like moths. Yes, there's no time of day for might escape this moth trait. I just like most of all those feathery antenna. The mere thought of them gives me feathers, goosebumps. And I'm no goose. <laughs> Any hoot. Uh, any hoot. I like that. My sincere thanks for your donation. And the bugs are the bane of my existence. Best to show the wretched things will get the best of care here. Yes, I do have plenty of things. Here you go. This fish. Oh, this is undoubtedly a Crucian Carp. Now, might I interested a few fascinating facts about your Crucian Carp? Wonderful! Another love nothing more. I wonder, do you know how to tell the difference between a Crucian Carp and a standard issue Carp? Isn't it the face hair? It's quite easy to tell the two apart. I must simply locate the barbels, rather the lack of them. Just what is a bobble, you ask? Or not m face hair. It looks like face hair. Well, a bobble looks like a something like a mustache. There you go. Uh, one of the little carp is both the unsightly facial hair, while a crucian carp is considerably better groomed. I tried to grow a mustache when I was younger, but it never fell in quite right. Off is best thing, as messages go so much better with noses than with beaks. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no. I don't think I had anything else to give him, right? Let's see. I got something. Marvelous. What would you like to donate? Oh, the hermit crab. There you go. <laughs> you don't like hermit crabs? Hermit crab. What a wretched thing. Glass on my blood, you ask. Would you like to learn more about the specimen? Ah, uh, see. In that case... <clears throat> A hermit crab is not an insect. It almost certainly resembles one. Look. It looks much like a spider with its creepy eyes and crawly legs, but it is, in fact, a crustacean. As such, the hermit crab has ten legs and also wears a shell. But it does, of course, the shell is shelf. A soft body and a shell is left behind by snails, you see. It moves into ever larger ones as it grows. That process of them getting in and out of shells is goosh. Look it up online. Talk about a strange way to make a home. Anywho, thanks for your donation. Maybe yeah, if we did this. Hold on. Make sure I'm not. Yuri, I love that. That looks like a turtle. Yeah, owlsy moths. That's why I was like, why is he collecting all the insects and the bugs? And I think it's because he's eating them. All right. Hey, the moth isn't here. I don't have a... Oh, shit. I didn't even have a... I can't... Dude, I can't think. Net. That's the word. I didn't even have a net yet. It's, I think it's five, right? Oh, fuck! Of course! Of course! The worst one I... Th oh, the first one I shake is full of fucking wasps. Of course. God damn it. That's annoying. All right, well, now I need these. I oh, nope, the moth is there. Three, four, five. Stupid fucking moths. Oh, there's one. What if I shake it now? 
Give me more than that. Come on. If this comes out with moth, I'm losing my mind. Oh. Holy crap, that scared the crap out of me, Pancake. Thank you so much for the host, friend. You know what? I'm not shaking anything. I'm not chanting any of that garbage. I'm just gonna pick these guys up. I think that's five. All right. I want that super pretty butterfly, though. So please hold. Oh, yeah, I forgot antibiotics fuck his birth control. Holy crap. Uh, oh, these guys are popping. You see, since the number of homeowners is increasing, I agree that we need to build a shop. However, when it comes to building supplies, the customer's home should take priority. I am very confident that you'll find a way to handle this little puzzle. The two of you have been training under me for how many years now? Hmm? This should be a piece of cake. I forgot his voice. I'm getting it mixed with blathers. Well, hello there, Vasive. There it is. Are you happy with your home? Just meeting your new expectations. I haven't even been in my home yet. I bet you'll be more comfortable now. That's just so different from tents, hmm? We can freely change up the flooring and the wallpaper. Ooh. And we've got some built-in storage so you can put away your furniture you are using. Oh, fuck yes. Oh, yes! There's more. All the homeowners are automatically rich with the Happy Home Academy. The HHA, as we call it, will evaluate your home on a regular basis and send you helpful advice. They even send rewards to members whose homes achieve high ratings. Their evaluations won't intrude on your day-to-day -day life. So there's no need to worry. Just enjoy the fun. Which brings us to... A new home loan! That'll be 98,000 bells, please. Uh, can I pay in miles? Oh, I'm sorry. That's a special offer that only applied to your initial getaway package fees. Of course it did. Fuck. You have to make loan payments with bells now. Uh, but don't worry. You can pay in installments, big or small. Oh, sweet. Payments can be made using the ABD feature of the Nook Shop. I think that's everything I need to tell you about homes today. But I do have a nice surprise for you. I do hope you're ready for this. It's a premium Miles Redemption item. A Nook Miles ticket. A Nook Miles ticket. Nook Miles ticket is a special travel voucher. One that you can get by redeeming Nook Miles. It's a conundrum, hmm? We want to improve our island, but still hold on to that deserted island magic. Right now, you can do both. You can use one of these tickets to do some island hopping adventuring. Yes, yes. Go anytime you want. Maybe you're looking to meet some new characters or gather materials for DIY projects. Your trip is yours to enjoy in, in the way you like. I've left a ticket at the counter in the airport, so use it whenever your travel mood strikes. Now then, go enjoy your life in a freshly built home, indeed. I need to sell things. How are they wasted? Congratulations on your new home. There's something I'd like to chat about. Have a moment. It is a bit of a proposal for now. Not a good time, I understand. Complete ain't no pressure. Sure, go ahead and chat. Well, good. I'll get right to the point. I'm hoping that you might be interested in collaborating on a new adventure. Building a new shop. After all, our little island community is growing. And our needs are growing too. I'd love to offer a much wider inventory of goods. But as you can see, I'm a bit limited here. I've already spoken with our fearless leader, of course, and he agrees that we have, have a need. Look at his face. Oh, but here's the thing. Building materials are hard to get so we set them aside for building a shop. I really don't see it since we need those materials for residential projects, but I have an idea. Just ask if we gather up the materials from around the island, right? The trees and rocks? Our environmental review even suggests that there will be zero impact to native flora or fauna. But I'm getting off track. We need a lot of materials for a proper shop. We will, of course, offer compensation for your efforts. Okay. Oh, I should just said, sure, I help. Thank you so much. Yeah, I know this is a lot, but I put together this set and I'd like two together. Only 30 pieces of regular wood, hardwood, and softwood. Shit. And 30 iron nuggets. Jeez. I'm not concerned about where these materials come from. They could come from either or any other. And you can gather these materials in your own piece. Once you have a set of something, come see me. Cool. Yeah! Mm, what's going on, Sierra? Welcome to the stream, my guy. Oh, crap. I missed uh, some chat. Sorry. Uh. While working. Oh, 
really, Pancake? Did you have that experience? That sounds awful. You smell like a mint chocolate whoop. What's a whoop? Oh, you smell like mint and chocolate whoop. Got it. I thought you said you smell like a mint chocolate whoop. <laughs> What's going on, cereal? How you doing, my dude? I'm sorry, guys. I'm very tired. Like, my brain is groggy. I, I woke up not too long ago. Uh, I want to sell. I do want to go catch that pretty butterfly. So, um, this and this and this and this and this and this and this and... Oh, I need to make medicine. Stupid stinking bees. Wasps. Bees are cool. Wasps suck. Wasps are... Whoa, that's a lot of money. Are assholes with wings. <laughs> Trying to make them very nice. You've... Oh, were you really tired this earlier this week? Man, my, my schedule's so jacked. Like, I'm proud of myself for actually staying awake to get all my work done and put in eight hours straight, but I immediately went and took a nap. I was like, I need it. I'm so tired. I made a flimsy net. Can I make a better net? Oh, I need to make medicine. Remind me to make medicine, please. Oh, hell yeah. Look at him crap. It's adorable. Where's medicine? I didn't pick up the wasp nest. Uh, I thought I did. You're still playing Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> really? Dang, dude. Wasp or bug. You are mine. Nope. Mine. Nope. Wait. I have to be on the right side of him for some reason. All right, let's go get the stupid stinking. Did I sell it on accident? There's something glowing there. Fuck. I sold it on accident. Did I sell it on accident, guys? Am I stupid? Oh, hey, my friend is over there. Hello. Look at my house. We should check out my house. Good things along. Here go. Thanks. Oh, rock. Thanks. I was gonna make the iron nuggets and some free weights, but having straps sounds way cooler. The faster we get a shop, the faster I can buy free weights. Go Team Crunch Town Chips. Team Crunch Chips. Yep. Look at all my presents. Oh, wait. I got a thing. What was this? All right, throw that away. Nook shopping. Oh, I got my I got my scooter. You're evasive. Whenever you see a plane, I think of you and wave at those airborne strangers with all my might. That's mom. I had no idea how many flights took off each day. My arm is exhausted. All right, I got a couple presents. All right, what did I get? I got heckin' scooter, yo. Can I just put it in front of my house? Like right here. Damn it. All right, let's go in here. Holy crap, I have a little bell thing now. With the ammonia in inhalants. Her bedside manner with those needs of work. <laughs> the smell penetrated my dreams. Oh, gross. That's phony. Phony. Funny. Don't hold them in front of someone's face for a while. Oh my god, Sarah. I love that. That's hilarious. Congratulations on the construction of your new home. Here are a few tips for comfortable little bit. Turn lights on or off. Enter decorating. Oh. Enter decorating mode. Open storage. When lights are on or off, you can make the room brighter or dimmer with this option. Ooh, mood lighting. Enter decorating mode, which lets you easily make design changes to an entire room. Access your home storage to stash or retrieve items. Dope. 
When in your home, you can open your pockets to select furniture or other items to put in storage. Okay. I'm putting this into storage because this is useless. Oh, wrong button. Uh. Oh, put it in storage. Okay. I'm going to put my little kick scooter right here. There's two room. Look at my face. It's all jacked. Not that. Yeah, look at my little scooter. What is this? I got... I got peaches. Wooden mini table. Oh, it's a DIY project. I like that. Thanks. Yay. Might have to build that. Also... What are the buttons? I uh, linked Nook Link. Nintendo Switch Online app for... I did that. Wow, there's a lot. Oh! You want? Yes. I made one online. Yes! Hold up. Where is it? Wait, it's none of those. Why didn't it work? Frog name was found. Please select a save slot. Oh, you have to do it here. Okay. Yeah, look at him. You'll need to upgrade your custom designs app. What? Why? Why? No! I want to wear it! No! Look at that! It's adorable. <sighs> That's annoying. I was all excited I was going to have a, a doggo thing. Or I should put that can in a save slot. We got to go find that butterfly again. <laughs> Ah, loud. All right. Come here, fish. Need you. I 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 need you. Oh. Yep. Pockets are full. There we go. See, this moth is always here. Oh, wait, I don't have room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, moth. Another one. Maybe it's because I play at night. I could be it. Hi. I got a bunch of presents for you. Here's a goby. Oh, wait, this is a freshwater goby. Am I not interested in a few fascinating facts about your freshwater goby? Please tell me I forgot his voice. Wonderful, I would love nothing more. The freshwater goby is an assuming, unassuming specimen. Up in that calm fish exerts. Throw glass in his eyes. It will eat anything will fit in his mouth. And his mouth is quite the gaping maw, so I recommend you refrain from drawing attention to yourself. And there you have it! Yep, yep, yep. Yep, I do. I got lots. Got lots of things. This wharf war roach, this thing is nasty. A wharf roach? What a wretched thing. So last time I'm obliged to ask, would you like to learn more about this specimen? Oh, see. In that case, um, a wolf roach is an omnivore, which is merely a polite way of saying it will eat almost anything. It's getting a scavenger and its uncouth appetite. Help keep beaches clean, it said. I dare say the long antenna in Bozica is turned my stomach. Unappetizing indeed. Alright, yep, 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 yep. Blah, 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 blah,
I wish I could mass donate. There's a black bass. What is it? This must be a black bass. Yep, I want to know some facts. The black bass is a formidably strong fish and is such a common target for sports anglers. In some areas, there are even those who professionally catch just black bass. And in other areas, there are, where they are non native, they are considered an ecological nuisance. Nuisance. Invasive, even. Oh, can I help but wonder who is to blame for the invasion, too? And there you have it! Yep, 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 yep. I want him to put something in that little tank. Sea butterfly. Undoubtedly a sea butterfly. Yep, I want to know a secret. Such mystery, such grace. Did you know that sea butterfly's scientific name is Thicosomata? The real translation of this is shell body. Indeed, this illustrious creature is related to snails. Oh, it reminds me much more of an elegant feathered friend. The way it flies through the air. The water. With such grace in flying, one should wonder if it's too related to the owl. Hoo -hoo. There you have it. I like that his chest looks like he's wearing a sweater vest. His pattern. <laughs> Here you go. I have this guy. Oh, why, this is loach. Yep, I want to know more. Loach is a large group of bottom feeding freshwater fish. Because there are so many species, it is difficult to generalize about them all. But then they all have in common is perhaps the most unappealing trait the name loach. Repellent, isn't it? They should have just called him the cock loach. Be done with it. It won't. Loach, loach, it just tastes terrible in the beak. <laughs> he does eat him. Only six more? Alright, I know I have two more outside. If I can find that butterfly. Alright, we'll do the beach stuff in a minute. I want this. No, wait. Wait, didn't I get a... I thought I got a pattern. I still needed to learn. One, two, fish! We'll catch this boy. And just hope he's a new fish. Why? There you go. Nailed it. Give, give that fish. No, oh, caught one of those before. Okay, though I got something for that. Oh, nice. Thanks for the miles. Catch a moth. I can do that. And where one spawns a hundred percent of the time. Oops. Another goby. That big fish. You want some of this? You do. Dang it. Keep getting the same fish. Something's glowing there. Oh, maybe I need the shovel for that. Because they give me that recipe. Maybe I should go build that real quick. No, I can't carry anything else. I thought I had a lot more room. All right, get out of here, moth. You 
just sitting there. Uh. Oh. I'm here. Wait. I don't want to mess up on what things I've given. Uh. Fuck. <laughs> I have a thing to catch a moth. I do. You want some? Here you go. This guy. All right. Back to about a days. It's a shiny little fish that enjoy fresh water streams with gravelly bottoms and plenty of sunlight. What a fish in paradise until the larger fish move in and begin eating the days. Sadly, the shiny days are easy to us for other fish to spot, which makes them a popular snack. However, this particular specimen here has no need to worry. There's a strict no eating your neighbor policy at the institution. That's funny. Yep. If I get lucky, I might be able to finish this today. Oh, crap. Nope. I thought I was going to give him three things, but the other one was a daze, too. A squid! First off, squids are members of the mollusk family, just like the octopus. Many mollusks like snails and clams have shells, but the squid's body is almost completely soft. The exception is a long, narrow bit of hard material going through its main body, the last remnant of its shell. Of course, having your shell inside isn't the best practice. Perhaps they lost the owner's manual. And there you have it. The owner's manual. All right. Four more donations. Hey, moth. Yeah. Nope. Why do I suck at this all of a sudden? My... Is my depth perception garbage right now? It looks like it's in front of me. Ha! Ha! Are you just stuck somewhere, stupid moth? There. Got him. All right. Yep. Claim them miles. Oh, I have to check the shop. Oh, I gotta go beat on some rocks. I can do that. I'm not too scared to beat on some rocks. Might as well catch you. He says when he can't catch him. Alright, let's go sell some stuff. Build us a shovel. Go beat on some rocks. Mm. Hi, friend. Uh, let's see. This, 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 this. Twenty-five hundred bells, sweet. Thank you. All right. Stupid wasp thing. Um, oh, cool. Oh, I need five softwood, five hardwood. Okay. All right, so maybe not yet. We got to go beat on some wood. Five softwood, five hardwood. Oh, yeah, that's right. It gives you bonus miles when you visit this. Ooh, a plant. I kind of love it. Look at those shades, yo. Hey, it's a dog picture. I'm gonna buy that. Just cuz. Uh, redeem McMiles. Oh, that's what I need. 
Yes. That's what I need for my dog shirt. I need better pants. Sweet. Give me dancing. With my messed up eye. <laughs> one anything else i want i kind of want to get that i think that might be an inventory thing she tried to be nice but you were hard to wake so she just kind of got sick of it and just here smell this smell it <laughs> that's still funny all right my tea is ready that i am not peeing into a bottle right now or am i better hope not that's gross. Mmm. That's hitting the spot right now. Oof. Wait a minute. We got new stuff in here. I kind of want to buy some new hairstyles because my stuff sucks. Hello, I like this backpack. Friend. Crimson, how's it going, friendo? Welcome to the stream. Ooh. Got a rug. Okay, sign off. Also, I was gonna change. Um. Edit color palettes. Oh. That's significant. I thought I had to work with the stuff I already had. I did make this one. Look at my GG shirt. Also, I'm going to edit this one. We're going to give it. Oh, never mind. It's already small. I was going to make it more of a, a rounded. Yeah, look at the GG emote shirt. Yes. Oh, I freaking love it. <laughs> that makes me happy. Okay. What was I doing? Oh, I need to go. I need to build a shovel. Ah, oh, damn it. I was going to visit a little kid's shop. You freaking. There you go. All right. I need to visit his shop real quick. And then we're gonna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's for sale? That's what I was looking for. That was there yesterday. Wasn't it? Don't I have one of those? Okay, I'll buy a smoker. I'm gonna run out of money. I'm going to get kneecapped by Tom Nook for not paying back my loan. Oh, there's a red hyacinth. I need three. buy the tulips too because I have what kind of tulips do I have do you guys remember what kind of tulips I have sure oh okay so it's something I already own I thought it was just like kind of random stuff sure I'll get some white tulips one Three. I just spent half my money already. Okay, let's go. 
So for the D&D campaign, are we fighting against orcs and goblins? Uh, you're fighting against whatever I decide to throw at you. <laughs> Look, you can aim this. That's awesome. It's not helping. There it goes. I need to talk to Cherry wherever she's at. Oh, I got two things to claim. Heck yeah. Got me some bugs. Complete DIY projects. Chop wood. Plant trees. All right, let's go chop some wood. Let's start by uh, my house. Also, I need to beat these rocks, so maybe we'll do that in a second. Actually, these are the highest synths. These are the highest synths, right? fish all right i need to water these also don't i have a quick i do not that let's water my flowers yo did i get them all oh jeez, dude awesome heck yeah give me them miles back them all. Uh, these ones I will water right now. We'll come back to them when uh, I have to build some more. Cool. Watered. Then we're gonna... Not that. It's a quicker button. In case of freaking assholes are in here. Oh, dude, dropping five wood on me. Like that. There's a fish over there, by the way. I need to get used to this. Wow, I missed. All right, only three. There's... This is breaking my brain. There's so much around me to do. Terrifying ass spider. I missed. I don't know what I picked up. Oh, it came back. That's nice. Catch the spider. There we go. Oh, that thing gives me the... Ah, I hate it. My spider first. Nice. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, they can drop more than five. This tree is spitting wood, guys. It's a wood spitter. I like this tree. This is a lucky tree. Not that. All right, let's bonk it. Okay, I only think it can ever drop three. Stop. It's habit to do that. There's all these fish around. Yeah. 
You don't have cherry blossom trees. Hmm? No. I don't think so, anyway. These are the only trees I've seen so far. Well, that tree's worthless. that thing fossils assessed All right there was something that I needed to do to build that came with um or that needed the soft wood and I don't remember what it was it's gonna oops beat on a few of these Because I think these actually can spit out multiple colors, different types of wood. Oops. It dropped a leaf. Teacher's desk, is that what that just said? Hold up. What is the teacher's desk doing in a tree? Hey guys. Damn it. What's green? And if it fell out of a tree, it would kill you. A pool table. So I guess that joke makes sense now. If a teacher's desk can be in a tree, why not a pool table? This needs to move. Uh. Alright, we're just going to drop this down real quick. Because we have to make room. I'm going to pick this up. And we're going to store that. We can make more of those later. I wish I could ride my scooter. Bunny day. Bunny day. <gasps> no! Fuck. I panicked. I didn't know it would disappear so quickly. That's unfortunate. What did I do now? Shady shakedown. They had heart furniture and trees. That's hilarious. I did this one, right? This thing's spitting wood. Is there a group pickup? Because I'm impatient. How did I not do this tree yet? It's right in front of my house. Although, I would like to dig up or move these trees. Excuse me. Okay. See, look, three different colors. Uh, maybe that one's because it's in shadow nope there's three different wood oh I still need two of those okay cherry are you down by the water again I think one of my recipes required five or something like that. Um, miss. Ba doo doo boo. 
ba do do boom boom Okay. Oh, it's probably because the weeds were around. Ooh. Thank you, tree. I'm paranoid about wasps and stuff. I don't know if you can actually catch them, but... I like to think that I can. How's it looking? Oh, I got a bunch of them. Should I finish off... My, um... Should I give them a new store first? You think? Or should I... Build my own stuff first? You know? Because... I wonder if I can get enough... Although I'm scared. I don't want to get stung again. I heard bad things happen if you get stung again. should be doing is oops fuck oh oh it worked fuck yeah you flying assholes oh yes i have to swap it for something else because they will come after me fucking assholes oh my god oh Oh shit, I need those to make medicine. God damn it. All right, hold on. I need to drop something. Fuck this moth. Oh yeah, you can just place them. You don't have to release them. Jeez. This is mine. Fucking assholes. You're gonna make me some goddamn medicine. Wait, no, I gotta, I gotta go give them to the Blathers first. Blathers, I've caught you some bugs. You're gonna hate it an easier event. Oh, yeah, I'm not going to have that for another week. Can you not catch... What, what do you do with them? I didn't know you could catch them with you now. I just panicked. You're going to work. There's a spider. Yeah, you me too, bro. Yes, I want to learn about it. The spider is renowned for not for having eight legs, eight eyes, and eight legs. Which is six too many eyes, eh? Oh dear, I do apologize. Now where was I? All spiders are carnivorous. In fact, some will eat creatures several times larger than themselves. To catch prey, many of these ruthless predators spin sticky webs of surprising strength. Of course, yet they also been known to ambush the victims, and some even chase down their meals. Yeah. Ugh. Have you guys seen spider chasing down its meal? Oh, gives me the heebies. Want to talk about feeding habits of spiders? It's I'm feeling quite unqueasy. Oh, the horror. Yep. This guy. Sorry, these guys are assholes. Yeah, we need to fact about you. Wasps are sometimes called meat bees because they eat meat. Meat! Of almost any sort. If you've seen what a menace they make of themselves at picnics, it's hardly the worst of it. <laughs> uh, predators, predators with venomous stingers. Wasps not only hunt and eat other insects, they paralyze their prey and drag their victims home alive, leaving them for the lava to feed upon. Suddenly, a simple sting seems quite tolerable. <laughs> 
Two more donations. I can do that. Oh, I can put stuff in storage from anywhere, right? Can I do... Nope. Guess not. I need to build my own workbench. That's what I need to do. Maybe... Let me run up here. Drop some crap off. Bummer that I have to be at home. Maybe it'll come up with the technology that I can do it while not at home. But... This in storage. That's the only thing I need to put in storage, I guess. Whoops. I might have to take off my uh, sweater. It's getting hot. Hot tea. Buddy. Hey, it's a nice little smoker. Alright, let's go back down. Finish this couple trees down here. There better not be wasps in here again. Oh, that wood came flying out and I thought it was a wasp nest and I was about to scream. gathering good little wood gatherers no not that mm, yeah. I know we've got a million of those it's exciting all right so first off we need to build a workbench we need to build a shovel somehow I don't remember how to build a shovel Carry my workbench around? That'd be sweet. Medicine. Fucking... Yes. Yes, I forgot. Medicine first. Oh, this thing. The vaulting pole. That's right. Ha! I can create a shovel. A super shovel. Five iron nuggets. Oh wait, one. Never mind. I have five. And then, uh, yeah. Oh, that's what the soft wood was for. Oh, I got no po pockets. Okay, let's uh, fix my face. I'm all better. Oh, I need to make workbench base if you dumb. There we go. All right, now I got to sell stuff to make room. give you a moth and another moth and uh, another moth. How you like that? There you go. That's some moths. I kind of want some peach trees about my house. Sounds kind of cool. Alright, let's What did I need need to make? The vaulting pole? I don't remember. Hold on a minute. Oops. Yeah, 
Yay. Wharf roach. I know where those are at. All right, what do we got? I need a... Yes, I need a vaulting pole. This guy. Yeah, I did a thing. You made your character for the DD campaign. Nice, Pancake. Boop, that nose. All right, guys, we got a vaulting pole. We got a, a vaulting pole. We got a hermit crab. Um, I'm going to go. Message in a bottle, baby. Damn it. I thought I got rid of everything in my pockets. I need more freaking room. This is awful. Alright, get out of here, hermit crab. Where was that shiny? There it is. Damn it. Oh, there's a recipe in here. Whoever fishes this out of the surf, bet you weren't expecting to find a DIY recipe washed up in a bottle. Keep an open mind, I always say this crafting project is something to help you reflect, build it, and you'll see what I'm getting at. A wooden table mirror. Nice. Yay, I won. Dig this up. Hiya! Money! I dug up money. Why is it still shiny? Is there more in there? Alright. I just covered it back up. Okay. Seagull friend. Hey! Is that a clam? A clam! I got a manila clam. Manila is my favorite flavor of ice cream. Nice. I don't have any room? Oh, the bells didn't go in my pocket. Why didn't the bells go in my pocket? Oh, those are fishing bait. Oops. Wrong button. How do I put these in my money? Oh. Not that. Oh! You can... Okay, you can hear your thing. Look at this seagull. Oh, you walked up, Hank. Um, take us a little mark. Wake up. I know it's nighttime. Um... I want to be a flotsam. Can I be a jetsam? It sounds more fucking yes. We need to give him a voice. He speaks funny. Ugh. Sorry, fellas. I already licked all these cookies. And the test for raisins. <laughs> I like this guy. Tell me more. Oh, waves. Waves are... Ready the pool, doodles. I love this guy. Is he gonna run out of text? Oh. Oh, he woke up. Do you have any pickled herring pizza? I'm ready. I'm already tipped online. So, uh, wait, I don't see any oh my god, that scared me. Wait, I don't see the pizza. Where am I? Where are you? Where am I? Oh, hang on. I know that one. Hold on. Whoa. Whoa, I missed a lot of chat. I am so sorry. Made a half elf ranger. Nice. Yeah, rangers are uh, generally a lot of people's like first classes. It's usually the animal companion that <laughs> people are drawn to. I'd like to petition for an animal friend. <laughs> well, that's uh, one of your things you get 
in a, as a ranger. I think you have to be level three or something. All rogues matter if you burn money. And it makes you can get money trees. Not allowed to play my cleric for the foreseeable future. He almost made a cup that had D20 on it. And stated Caddick, stupid is not an alignment. I love it. He's a megalomaniac psychopath, even though he's actually good and his alignment is evil because he's not opposed to torture. How is your patron god not banned you from using any of your spells as a cleric? He's in prison pissing off his own town guard. She only basically helped him. She overkilled someone without meaning to. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> I'm little over from Gulliver, a sea very single of a seven seas. Read the one of Ken Dungy Beaches now. Thanks for wake up, Paul. Those toasty hallucinations had to sneak up on me. Then he flooded into heart to forget this waterlogged bird brain. I'm ready to get a naked expression now, oh yes. I guess I dove off and tumbled overboard again. That's an endearing character trait of mine. My crewmakers love when I slip out for the bow. <laughs> Don't worry, the fellows will be here to rescue me in no time. I got an ace of my wing, you see. I'll just call for help using my handy dandy. Uh. But, uh, oh my gosh. My handy dandy communicator is broken. This is the handy or dandy. Oh, sardines, it's all cracked and busted. Looks like something's missing a few communicator parts. Now we get to the way for the fight to be on their own. I could take a while. Ugh, I've only got enough nautical puns to last for a couple of hours. Make you it really look like communicator parts, please. Sure. Really? Wow. I haven't gotten a perception of the street bubbly since I watched up at Old Coracola. The communicator parts are probably buried in the sand somewhere. Just missing five parts, so if you'll find them, I'll try to cut them back in here. I'm sure my crewmates are looking for me, so better stay here and watch for the boat. I'll look at searching too. I believe in you, partner. Okay. Aha! Bam! Four apart! Okay. I thought it was going to be another clam. Get rid of the sand dollar. It's not useful. I can bury it in a hole. Okay. Alright, is this Cherry's house? We need to talk to Cherry. Cherry! Your inside of your tent looks just like you. As long as you're here, you might as well hang out. What? Oh, yeah. I heard you guys have slept together for a show. That's right. Uh, anyway, well, thanks for doing your part for Crunk Town. No, friend. Gaps! No problem, my dude. Playing MC. What's MC? Say, take a photo treaties. Yum. God of knowledge and truth, I've. I haven't crossed him, praise be. <laughs> and then frantically heal the person? Can you have evil gut? Yes, you can, but if uh, you do a good deed, they're supposed to revoke all your powers. It's pancake, but Irish. Minecraft, got gotcha. you. You can have evil gods as cleric, mine is cleric wisdom, nothing matters. So what if you need to skin a hair, take a life a once in a while? He'd still perform life rights of the dead. <laughs> Even the heretics. <laughs> There's a, a moth near you. Well, we gotta find some parts. Do I have enough space? Oh, I needed to beat on some rocks. How do I, can I beat on some rocks with the shovel? I can. Low battery. Damn it. Oh, 
No! Drop it. Oh, that's clay. I'm gonna have to pick that up. Also, give this so I can charge my controller. That is a huge moth. Pancog. I love it. Oh, right. I have that. Can I plant these peaches? I'm gonna see if I can plant these peaches. Really love your peaches, want to shake your tree. This rock is annoying. Right here. One. Two. Three. I can plant. I can plant. Something's bleeping at me. Fruit roots. Oh, nice. Now, do I need to water these? Not sure. Here you go. Here you go. Wait. Look at the look at the hole. There you go. Now we're gonna water them. Well, they don't get glowy, so I don't know if it does anything. Um. Oh! Oh, oh! Oh, oh! Guy said yesterday that if you eat a fruit, you get strong, and then you can dig up trees. Hell yeah! Moving this. Oh, it uses one energy. Oops. Damn it. So I need to super energize myself to do this. Eat. Okay. Uses the energies. I got it. What I should be doing is just putting the trees next to each other. Make my life easier. Damn it. Be doing that. Oh, this one's an, a special tree. All right. Sweet. We got some room. I might move this tree. Eat another fruit. No. No. Damn it. Eat the orange. Orange juice for power. I'm going to break my shovel by just accidentally digging things that I don't need to be digging. Alright, put this here. Ooh, stick. Stupid moth. I have to catch it. My brain won't let me. Ah, uh, ha-ha! Gotta be on the right side. Get him! Okay. <laughs> the dead need to be loved a bit. Yes, I'll be vo uh, doing voice stuff. Crimson. Last mass burial was the individual graves. Jeez. The head of a giant cider that was eating people. Or, cause, probably because I was singing it. <laughs> Pancake. 
I want to sell. And then I'm going to sell you this moth. That I literally just cut outside your thing. Enjoy. 130 bells. Nice. They're almost not worth catching. All right, let me make... that food look at this adorable little mirror fish bait Ooh, ha -ha. yay i'm gonna go fish do i have to apply it how do i apply the fish bait screw you moth i'm not catching you anymore Scatter food. That's not how fish bait works. Hey fish, you're too far. Fishy, 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 fishy. All right. I buried that stupid thing. Fishies. I need this clay. Thank you. Ooh, thing. I yeah or miss. Why are you missing? Aha! All right, I'm wondering if you find them all immediately before you find more. Whatever. I'm great at this. Come on. Ah. Uh, no. Oh, you hop over them. Jeez. Over half my digs have been unintentional. All right, there's one over here. I saw it. There you are. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's another one. See you. Yeah, nailed it. How many more do I need? Oh, I got them all. Did you see all those hermit crabs? Jeez. Here, buddy, I got you a thing. Here you go. Good luck getting home. Hey, did you find them? Got them right here. Here you go. Oh, that's them. Those are definitely my communicator points. Come here, you little troublemakers. We ran the pieces of crab back in there. So let's see if this thing can send a message. Oh, hey there, who it's me, your brother from another brother. Nice. Well, oh, listen, it happened again. You hit a swing by to pick me up. Daddy McWordance now. Deliver over and out. They have to do it. The best things for really help. I promise to return the favor. You should have checked your mail in a few days and we get to send you something. It'll knock your flippers off. Just make sure you put some flippers on before you open it, okay? Uh, see, I have nothing to do now but piss back and forth for the next few hours. Better get started. Good luck, buddy. Something in here. Gulliver's. Trav oils. I love it. Trav ales. That's clever. I need a fish. I want to scatter this bait. See how this works. Fish. Little fish. You'll want to sprinkle this bait in a body of water with fish in it. I did. I guess that's the ocean. Okay. Oh, we'll catch this little boy then. He's a feisty bugger. 
Oh, it's a sea butterfly. Oh, oh. No. Give me you. Aha. I thought I had more room. God damn it. Why do I have these? Ha! Big hairy spider. Ugh. Don't like. Stay away from me, please. All right. Let's go build my freaking workbench. I should build it on the outside. That would be the smart thing to do. That'd be the real smart thing to do. I have so much crap. All right. Put in storage. Put in storage. Put in storage. I'm going to put pretty much all this in storage right now. Unless I have an immediate need. Which I might later, but I will have it. Oh yeah, I'll be taking on the voice of the characters, of course. You made yourself all bino. Pup or butt pats? I've heard he drops off on the ground. It stays overnight. I'm like, oh, how's it going, Coos? Thanks for the tip. Hey, <laughs> pup or butt pats? Get them, get them. Get them. Oh, I forgot to turn on your guys' light. Hold on a minute. Your daddy is rude. I also forgot to turn on my other lights. I forgot to turn on everything. Holy crap. Hold on. All the lights and stuff are off. There you go. Say, guys, and eat them, butt pets. Eat them. Eat them where you go, mama. Mm -hmm. Eat them, get 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 them. All right, I gotta take this off. It's getting hot. Please hold. Please hold. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, guys. What are you doing? We're not going anywhere. I'm just taking off the thing because it's stinking hot now. Oh, much better. Hi, doggy. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Say thank you for the butt pets. <laughs> I planted a shell on accident and uh, I'm far too lazy to go get it back. All right, let's put up uh, right here, I guess. Yeah, let's craft a thing. Nice. Oh, actually, you know what? I should keep this with me. Because then I can just craft stuff on the fly. Eh, I'll do that later. We need to find a fish. In this body of water. There's one. Hold that. Not that. Here you go. You want some fishy fishies fishies? Oh look, another fish. Two fish showed up. Or one fish showed up. So it's a fish summoner, not a... an attractor. Who's gonna get it? This one. Oh, the other one got scared. It's the same stinking fish! That's lame. About here. Here you go. Oh, baby fish. That was way too far. Okay. Back up, fish. Aha. Oh. Ah. I wasted my stuff. I think quarantine isn't helping you much. Yeah. <laughs> My uh, brain is kind of shot for the most part. What am I doing? Um, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I can jump over that stuff now. I 
think. Oh, no, no, no. How much, um... How many Nook Miles do I have? How do I figure that out? Is that enough? I think this might... <laughs> Open this! I think that one thing might be a, an inventory expansion, which I freaking need. Did I not pick up my workbench? I'm a dumb. I don't think I picked up my workbench. Redeem Nook Miles. Yes. I barely have enough. I hope this is... Inventory. Because... My tools take up half my inventory as is. Huzzah! Learn some tricks for organizing me as long as I can carry it. Yay! How much more? Oh. Heck yeah. Oh, that's great. All right, I'm excited. Oh, you definitely work? Uh, Yuri, you just don't check Discord, you turd. <laughs> also, it's a, it's a command in the channel right now. Yeah. Yep. You're all, you all are invited. <gasps> bugs. Look at those bugs. Yum! Ha ha! Where'd the other one go? A tiger beetle. I pounce first. There he is. Cool. I think we need one more different animal. Look at that big fish. We need him. We're gonna go get that big fish. Not you. How do I use it? Hi hey, oranges. I don't need these, but they're mine now. Oh, there's a body of water. I should have scattered my stuff in. Don't take that out of context. It sounds weird. You're mine! Please be a different fish. Oh, Hamilton, push it. You're the same fish. Worthless. Dang it. All right. Oops. All right, keep an eye open for glowy things on the ground. <gasps> There's something to dig up. Oh, look at the pretty flowers up there. We need them. Oh, a fossil. Hell yeah. Okay, so they're not glowing. A fish down there. Oh, I finished one of these. Okay. Bonafide bone finder. Like your mom. Hot! TOS. I want those flowers. Dude, <gasps> there's a beetle up there too. I need to get up there. How do I get up there? Fish. There you are. I don't know why my camera wasn't moving. Fish. You want it. You need it. You want it. No. Don't go for it. You stupid, stinking fish. God! Stupid fish. Look, it's right there. Go get it. You want it? Yes. Oh! First bite. Give me something new. It's a loach. God damn it. Oh. I know how many times I've played Danny. I'm not super confident in voice acting. Hey, that's totally... You don't have to. Crimson, of course, you don't have to. But as the DM, I'm going to try it. Plus, I have the little voice board, so it might help a little bit. It is totally up to you. It's up to your comfort level, Ev, of course. I might be Yuri. It's it's in the works. It's kind of a, more of a thought right now. 
Uh, although I have found a bunch of uh, resources and stuff that... Because everyone's in quarantine, you know, it's like the perfect time for it. And I've been finding a bunch of resources that really support uh, online campaigns now. And uh, there's actually a Discord bot that you can link up to D&D &D Beyond with, so it knows your character and you can do roles and stuff with the Discord bot and it'll tell you your results and stuff. It's pretty freaking cool. I was very impressed. And then uh, I started making stuff in D&D &D Beyond that I wanted to... Can I use my... Take it up here? No, but there's a bunch of stuff up there that I want. Look at all those pretty flowers and the bugs. Also, we found two fossils. I think we need one more fish. I'm right by the waterfall. You want a snack? You... Why do they always turn around? Oops. I wish you could cancel your cast. They always turn around like right when I cast. That's behind him. Nice. Oh, new fish! Come on! Damn it. Wait. No, that's the same one. Damn it. Well, I'm doing something, I guess. Catching fish. Cool. Cell fruit. Oh. Alright, maybe I do want to pick up all these. Will... Hey, question. Will wasps come out of the tree if I shake a tree that has fruit on it? Should I have my... whatever thing equipped? Instead of... Should I have my net? That's the word. I can think in English well. No. Wait, what happened to my other orange? It disappeared. How many oranges do I have? Not that. I have I have plenty of oranges. We're good. I wanna get up there. Look at all those cool flowers. Can I vault that? I need to get used to this still. Apparently there's one more tool I can use. Bug. Where am I floating present? Oh no! no. Yeah, roll d20. That was one of the resources I was looking at too. Don't know what channel this announcement was, but Sarah and I would probably... It's, uh, I created a whole new channel. It's, uh, the Dungeons and Dragons ones. Yeah, I figured you guys would be down. Give me a new fish. Bug. Damn it. All right, I don't think I'm getting any new fish. No, no, what I invite, because I just did it like Friday or something. Whatever I invited you to. Oh, I hear a present. It was forever ago. And, uh, <laughs> I have no idea what it was for. How do I use this? How do I use it? Does it have to be above me? That's annoying. How do I aim it? Or can I do this? What? This is the worst thing ever. What the hell is this? This is unusable. Got it. Present! No, present. Fucking open the goddamn present. Oh, you can't open it. You have to pick it up first. <laughs> then dogs heard present. I got a frog costume. Oh god, that's a nightmare. What happened to my shirt? What happened to the shirt that I made? 
All right, I'm a frog now. I don't know what happened to my shirt. I want those flowers, man. Or those... Yes, those flowers. That's what I was looking for. Oh, bug. I already have you, but... Stop walking away from me. Yeah! Got him. Uh, starting at level one. All the information is on the Discord. There's not much. It's just... Create a level one character uh, with... Uh, standard rules. Oh, hey. A little pier. And then uh, we'll have to figure it out from there. Hey, a little coral thing. I don't want you. Oh, yes. Is this the last one we need? I think we only needed three, right? Heck yeah. I do need one more different species of animal, though. gotta be a way up there oh hey i will indeed take that please and hold look like i'm wearing a, a teletubby onesie it's borderline terrifying yo how do i get up there there's all these flowers is there like a helicopter service or a zelda height thing I can use. No, come over here and land. Oh, I, my island is actually not that big. I just realized. I'm looking at the map and where haven't I gone? Not very much. Well, I need one more animal. It's really upsetting. Whee! Flathers! I found you some stuff. What say you? Here you go. Laughing because I want a cat companion. I want it to be like pancake, but not pancake since I'm pancog. So I told Frager he has the middle name. He thinks I made it up on the fly, which I don't. And I'm rambling now. <laughs> Pancake Marie. Oh, you need a ladder. Yeah, I'll be DMing. Oh, uh, Yuri. Ow. Ow. Yes. Make a donation. I have a tiger beetle. Oh, this is how you donate the fossils, too. Yes, I want to learn more about the tiger beetle. Ah, uh, okay. The tiger beetle is extremely fleet of foot, though it runs in a rather peculiar way. That is, it sprints, then stops, then sprints again, using these speedy maneuvers to run down its prey. You see, the tiger beetle, like a real tiger, is a powerful predator. The mere thought of it giving chase gives me the willies. Tigers are terrifying at any size. No problem. Enjoy your tiger beetle. I need one more. Do, hey, do these count as do, to the donations? That'd be pretty great. Here you go, got a fossil. Oh, there could be no doubt this is a fossil. Incredible, wonderful, remarkable. My intuition, intuition was impeccable. Our fossils on this island. But I digress. Back to the matter of queen. I must assess your fabulous find. Let me see here. Hmm, indeed. Oh -ho! Of course, I can need one thing. A diplo pelvis. What? Our feathers what a fabulous fossil. I would you believe we needed but one more item to complete the application to build the museum? Oh, fuck yeah, it worked. This diplo pelvis could quite literally be the key that knocks the doors to our institution. That's a little... It is with great inspiration that I ask, when do you donate this fossil? I'm donating it. Pego. Oh, how wonderful. Added this to our collection with the utmost taste. I never thought I'd lay eyes upon such a well preserved diplo pelvis. Yeah, may, might I give you a short presentation on the topic? I'm quite knowledgeable, you know. Sure, what is it? 
Wonderful! This is fascinating stuff, I assure you. Now, where to begin? And all the people, what would we do without you? This stout fellow embodied all the best in dinosaurs. It is a... Okay, it's a Diplodocus. Okay, I understand what that is. That's one of the... Swimmy guys. Those sturdy legs. Wait. I thought it was. Those sturdy legs. That man has been tailing above all that extraordinary neck. Oh, it's a long neck. Did you know that its center of gravity was just that... Was, was such that sitting up on its hind legs would probably... Was probably easy. What's more, paired with its long neck, the ability greatly increased its reach for eating plants. Mr. Maul Diplodocus grew. Probably grew its entire life having no adult size. With that, we were also gifted. That is what I have to say about that. Any good. I would gladly accept your generous donation. I only hope we can find what remains of this fossil and display it in the fully assembled form. Any thanks to you and best of luck. Yes, now then. This also applies to the fossil you bought this time, but... Only a specialist such as myself can appraise a newly discovered fossil to determine its proper designation. From now on, do please bring me any fossil of unknown origins as you find. Whether or not you choose to donate it is up to you. Either way, I shall gladly assess it. Hmm. I do believe this means... Yes! Huzzah! Hooray! We have acquired the number of specimens required. Our feathers. I meant to last for words. Never would have imagined we could reach our donation goal. On this, my very first day on the island. The generosity that made this possible. The passion. I am humbled by the spirit of Krongtown. <laughs> now we can submit our application to build a proper museum. Oh, oh, bye. We must make haste and prepare for the museum opening. There's so much to do. Hoody -hoo. Thank you so much, Faceof. Damn, that was a lot of talking. Here, I got more. Museum construction is about to begin, thus I cannot accept new donations at this time. Fuck! Other requests for fossil appraisals are still most welcome. Eh, I'll do it at another time. I will be here tomorrow due to the construction, so if you have fossils for me to assess, come by today. Okay, maybe I should assess them. Hello, friend! Who dat? Sarah, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Coming in with them treats. Thank you for the treaties. Thank you for the treaties. I missed some uh, chat. Hold on, I gotta catch up. Blathers was blathering on. Yeah, level one characters definitely suck. I agree. <laughs> Bring your monk, you'll get along. Crimson usually play tank. Nothing. Yeah, level one is very boring. It's pretty much you do one little encounter and then you tell everyone to level up. Actually, what I would do is um, I would recommend creating a level two and level three version of your characters. If if we do this, I would recommend creating level twos and levels three. So like once you level up, we don't have to wait for everyone to level up again. It's already ready to go. Um, That's what I always did in my campaigns. I always had the next level ready kind of thing. The ninja, you can't match. <laughs> like Naruto, <laughs> awesome, or like Samurai Jack. Well, Samurai Jack is a samurai. At night in level nine, he can move four times faster than a horse and be basically invisible. He dances between the stalactites. Nice. Oh, he's Elven origin. Got you. Went with the noble background. Yeah, yeah, basic rules. That's what we're following. Don't like, don't check the uh, critical role stuff and stuff because I don't know any of that. Okay, so I guess I have to appraise these. I thought the flatter. He's adorable. This one. Oh, I can do all of them. Oh, nice. That's exactly what I'd prefer. Oh, more than what I see. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Ooh, ooh, these are rare fossils, each and every one, and have not appeared in our collection. Perfect. I say you have quite the knack for finding valuable fossils. Once the museum, museum expands, I do hope you'll consider donating. Sure. Is there anything else I can help you with? That's it? That's that's all? Thanks. I cannot offer much in the way of hospitality, but I do make yourself comfortable. Can I use this? No. Alright. Well, I did that. Uh, I'm going to be getting a museum soon, which is kind of cool. What kind of fish did I want? 
Freshwater goby. Dang it. Uh, maybe I will donate the, uh, the wood and stuff I have. Look okay, at it. looks like I have a fucking bow staff. I'm gonna go beat some suckers. Come at me, bruh. Oh, I hate my onesie. <laughs> Okay, I kind of want to fix my house, but I'm going to do that at a later time. Oh, I need a lot more of these. All right, let's pick this up. Pick this up. Pick that up. Uh, I might just go start knocking down trees for a bit. I think that's what I need to do, right? Knock down some trees. Okay, did that one. The problem with having the axe out first is it just knocks. Alright, good to learn. Oh, uh, I need to put these away. Hold on. It's cool that it revealed what they were. Ah! Let's see. Uh. In storage. In storage. In storage. It wanted me to sell a bunch of fruit, so we'll keep that. We'll keep those. The rest is sellable in storage. I can hang that on the wall. <laughs> okay. Not that. I really kind of want to fix all these trees. So I don't have to cover my whole stinking island. All right, pop them branches. Thanks, phone. Okay. This there's a big old fatty fish up there. I see him. Miss. Cool, thanks, Tree. You're awesome. Oh, wait. These are the ones I may have already done this to. They're close to, um... What's his name? The Nooks. Yep. I'm pretty sure I already did these, but we're gonna do a quick check. Money, Tree! Heck yeah, money. No, my axe broke. All right, got to go make a new one. That's unfortunate. All right. We are going to... Oh, you know what? We should poke these. Let's do the rocks first. It's a money rock. That was... It's Mario sounds. I just made so much money from a rock. And here I was looking to destroy that rock. Good rock giving me money. Earn bales by selling stuff. Yep, we'll do that. All right, bonk. Not that. Fuck up my shovel doing this. Alright, look for more rocks. There's 
There's no rocks on the, uh... Sand, right? Phone. What are you doing? People talking in Discord, maybe? Oh, rocks. Damn it. Yep, that one already did. Still had to check. I don't think I have any more rocks on my island. How you doing, buddy? There's one. Nice. 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 Alright. Getting them rocks. I meant to carry my workbench around and I forgot to pick it up again. No. Don't hit it. Use it. Yes. I need a... A choppy thing. Yes. Oh yeah, heck yeah. I know, I think I know what uh, PDF you're talking about, Yuri's. Uh, we were using those too. Hmm. Also the Discord bot uh, that we can use. Uh, we'll actually do all that calculations and stuff for us too. We can, uh, we can tell it to assign damage and stuff and it'll keep track of all that information for us. I don't know if we're gonna use that. Uh, we might use the D20 system. Uh, or whatever, the thing that you linked, Yuri, because I was looking at that. There's a couple other ones online, too, uh, that can just track all that information for, for us as well. Uh, if it's a tool, Yuri, feel free to post it in the tools section of uh, the D&D &D stuff. That way, uh, everyone can use it. for uh, their campaigns. All right, build this better axe. Cause I'm impatient. All right, what are we looking like on resources? Didn't I pick up those other woods? Could have swore I did. Taking that with me. Yeah, the voice will be for Discord. Maps and stuff will probably be a, a tool we use. Oh, cool. Look at... Hey, it's a salamander. Move to pocket. Wait a minute. I had more wood than that. I could have swore... Oh, I used some, I, maybe I just didn't pay attention to how much wood the axes took. Holy crap. Dang it. That's unfortunate. All right. Get all these guys. Oh, I dropped a thing. Oops. Oops. All right, beat on this. Can't even see. There you go. This is gonna be very invigorating gameplay. Sorry, guys. Okay, 
Okay, get that one. Not that. drop one is that it nope then it can drop branches okay i'm okay with that so many branches i wonder if we could get um the nooks their new building thing but it sounds like a lot of time to invest just go beating on trees and stuff. I'm bummed my flowers didn't come in. I believe we already did this. Yep. Pretty sure we did this full line, so... I did you, right? Yep. I don't think I did you. Some that are covered in like 10 posts remember yeah right <laughs> just in case it mattered yeah that's one good thing about uh the digital ones too is because uh they'll uh they'll change their font size for information like that it's great he's the journal too sell carnal pleasure you seek carnal pleasure uh you guys didn't have to do um flaws and stuff if you didn't want those are uh more for uh, rp um i can't think of the word uh inspiration i guess is the word Yeah, you, you guys don't need uh, flaws or traits if you don't want them. But that is totally up to you. As long as you're following uh, the basic rules and creating the sheep, I'm okay with it. Also, I'm still trying to figure out the D&D Beyond thing because I created a campaign, obviously, that you guys can see. But I can't they're like they seem to be like one and done campaigns i've never played that way i always played like you had a story of just kind of a flowing thing and then in the D, &D beyond you have like encounters and stuff it's like well here's a campaign idea or here's a like a mission idea that i have for the campaign that should go here and here's the encounters for it here's another mission idea Here's the encounters for it, but that's not how DMD Beyond works. It's like it's supposed to be an all-encompassing thing, and it's it's gonna be difficult for my brain to try to keep that all in line. Although it is a fun tool to use, I've been creating stuff on it. Um, other people are apparently using them, which is pretty sweet. Um, but forgot where I was going with that. Oh, it's cool because it'll show you, like, uh, the difficulty level and stuff based on uh, the encounter and stuff, which is great to auto-calculate because I was like, well, I have no idea how many people are going to play. So, I have to just try to take a guess on how to make things difficult, but once I started making the encounter, I was like, oh, cool, it'll show me the bar of the difficulty, so all I have to do to make it more difficult or easy, I just have to add or remove creatures, and if that's too much, then I just kind of tweak a couple of the creatures, you know? It's pretty sweet. I hear wind. 
Where's the present? Sounds like it's going away from me. I see it. I see the shadow. Although this is probably the worst. Are you supposed to be in front of it? Yep. Oh, thanks, Tree, for the extra one. Why would we not want that? <laughs> Night Pancake, thanks for popping in. Yes, my airport opened today. Wasps, so. I wonder if I'll just do this. Like, check a bunch in a little area. Money tree! And then, yeah. Nice. No idea how my inventory is looking, but I'm guessing it's getting quite full. I already did these. I already did these. All right. I guess the island feels big as you're just running around, but as you're actually moving down a way to complete objectives, it's actually not that big. to go vault across some stuff i hope the vault the pole can't break because what if you vault across to the other side and then your pole breaks how shitty would that be you would never be able to get back okay money When he picks him up, it sounds like the uh, a food sound that I've heard in other games, where like people are eating. I can't place what game it's from, or it sounds like anyway. All right, you're gonna now you're gonna drop them. All right, thanks, friend. I like it, if it, the area is full, it just kind of launches them out. All right, any more trees? Got a couple more. I think I've already done this one. Maybe not. I hear another present. Where are you, present? I was gonna get that fish, but present is sounding. It sounds like it's going away. Present. To my left. Found you present. Do they come more at night or something? Because we've gotten a, a few right in succession here. I want to catch that fish. Oh, first try. Oops. My pockets are full. Damn it. 
Get rid of the coral. Nice. Oh, we got a bunch of stuff. Ah, uh, we're close on the hardwood. Oops. What is this? Hand knit socks. Let's wear them. Yes. Oh. I was wearing socks. Oh, I got another present. I forgot about this. Flashy flower sign. Well, what do you know? All right, we're going to have to go get a little bit more wood. Seek, sell, at least you're making money with the ladder. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> it's a smart way to go about it. All right, let's sell some garbage. How about a fish, a fish, a fish, a bug, a bug. I think they wanted me to sell some oranges or uh, fruit as well. So let's do that. Oh, I need so much more iron. That is unfortunate. You better give me like 10 grand, yo. Or not. I still got a lot of, uh... Oh, I only need to sell five. The iron to get. Which is unfortunate. Catch bugs, okay. Ding! I like their little wave sound. Their little goodbye. Okay. Let's, um... Oh, I forgot to pick these up. Did I not smack this tree? I could have swore I did. Yeah, I did. Alright, we're gonna cross this. Whee! on a bunch of rocks if you see it too. Oh, crap. I was going to see if I could give to these them individually. If I hit this... No! I was wondering if that was going to break. Now I got to use all my freaking wood. Dang it, man. <sighs> There's a rock. <gasps> Butterfly. There's a pretty one. That's the one we saw earlier. No, you... Oh, floaty bastard. Yes! You're mine! Emperor Butterfly. It's not your average monarch. Love it. All right, let's beat on this thing for a minute. What? Ah. Do I hear a present? I thought I heard a present. Probably did. Look at that big fish. I want to catch him. Please be something special and awesome. A yeah. right on his face. Okay. No. No. Damn it. Yeah. No, look straight. There you go. Oh. That got his attention. Give it the fish. Same stupid fish. Fun. Dang it, dude. All right, fine. Any other rocks? Rocks? Mm 
Although it looks like I don't need a springboard across anything because... Oh, yeah, I do. I can't get up there. Never mind. hi -ya! See if we find any more of them booter flies. Are there really no rocks? Come on. Come on. Where are the rocks? That's unfortunate. Really? No rocks? Lame. Lamers. Lamers, gamers. Well, definitely won't be able to finish the iron thing today. Kind of want to see what this is all about. Oh, I scared the fish. Never mind. Okay. Look at all them shells. Wee. Wait, I was going to make a... A workbench. Where is it? And then I gotta make... Are those boots? Oh, those are... <laughs> those are plans. Can't use it. I want it. Oh, it's the direction you place it. That's cool. Alright, I have plenty of those. I don't think I want to make an upgraded axe. Mm, I, I have plenty of that. I can totally do that. I'm okay with that. Oh, you have iron? Sweet. It's going to look like bunnies and eggs because the village will stop giving you Easter stuff. <laughs> Yeah, uh, if we start, it'll be on a weekend. I know that as much. It'd be like a Saturday or something. So hopefully have uh, more people be available. But um, yeah, I don't, I haven't really thought. I guess it depends on how many people show interest. I know there's a bunch of people that have, but I guess it depends on really how many people like want to create characters and stuff. Because it's either we all go in blind <laughs> Because there's a bunch of people. Or, yeah, I'll, I'll hit you up. This sounds good to me. Yeah, like I said, like right now, it's uh, a lot of it's just in the, up in the air. Because there's a lot to do. And it's... Really? None? The scary thing about DMing for me is, like, as soon as I feel like it's a commitment that I have to do it, I, I lose motivation. You know? What the hell? It's kind of like streaming. Like, um... Why can't I break these? Like, as soon as I feel like I have to do it, or I'm obligated, I don't feel like doing it, but as long as I keep it, it's like, you know, I'm just doing this for fun, and I can take time off as I want, or as I need. Like, like on a weekend or, or a weekday when I'm ge generally scheduled to stream. And I'm like, you know what? I'm not feeling it. I'm going to take time off. As opposed to DM, it feels like there's a little more pressure. Because there's a lot of people, like, depending on you. Or, like, this is one that gets me a lot. Is, uh, like, during weekdays, I can be totally stoked for D&D. &D. I can be stoked the day before and then the next day I wake up and I'm completely not feeling it or like having a, just a bad day in general, like anxiety, anxiety or something that I'm just like, man, I hate to cancel, but at the same time, I feel like I wouldn't be giving him my best effort, but at the same time, 
you know, I don't think I need to explain that much, but I think you guys understand. Like, at the very least, I would like to keep it casual. And, uh, and stuff, so that way that part of my brain doesn't freak out and say, yo, you don't want to play anymore. Because I have a lot of really cool ideas that I've always wanted to do in a campaign. I have a ton of them, and I've never been able to do it because every time I get close to doing a campaign, either something falls through or I, I lose motivation. Like, um, that campaign I did in Divinity Original Soul, Original Sin with my friends back in the day on stream. Um, that took many, many hours just to build the world itself just because I had to build it in the video game. And it was, it was at least 20 hours of building the game. And they burned through it in two hours. So that was difficult as well, but... It was really fun, and that was just, like, one of the ideas that I wanted to try out. And they actually really enjoyed it. And they had fun with it, but... I don't know. I'm rambling now. I'm a rambling man. Look at all them hermit crabs just hanging out. Oh, dude, you don't need to push up? Uh, maybe not. I was hoping that it would just be a... Like, I know the direction of the thing and it would just auto-select the axe, but it did not. It's unfortunate. Alright, how many more of these stinking things do I need? Alright, 30 wood. Oh, I'm done! All I need is a bunch of freaking iron. Cool, let's go back home. I'm gonna take these. You know what? Might as well, since I hit that on accident. I guess it's nice to have a little bit of a surplus, because I'm gonna be exhausting my freaking wood stock as soon as I go give this to the raccoons. Them trash pandas. Maybe I'll go pan plant a bunch of these. The fruit sells for a lot of money. Maybe I'll make like a... A fruit grove. That sounds kind of cool. Oh, my orange has disappeared. If they land where they can't spawn, they disappear. That's unfortunate. Alright, so let's clear these out. Oh, I don't have a shovel. I need to make a shovel. Maybe we'll make a little, uh, orange grove right here. What do you guys think? That sounds cool. There was a the thing that I needed to cut down a tree, right? Let's eat an orange. I remembered to push down. I'm proud of myself. Will this work? That's unfortunate. I suppose I could dig them up. Maybe I'll do that. I'll dig up these trees because they're not orange trees. Um, one of those might have been. It'll tell me. Bag. Stupid flying little mini moths. What time is it? Oh, I got 30 minutes. That's good. Session zero in which the players get together. I agree. Just to make sure I can get away with some things unless you give me... Carte Blanche. You're going to have to explain that. I'd like to do it because we just need a variety of things to do while stuck at home. I have bunches of iron I can give you. I guess it also depends if you guys want a continuation story, you know? Um, I have an idea that I would really love a continuation story, but if 
if it's more uh, viable to just do a bunch of one-offs, you know, that's something we can always do. Like a, it's a, a start and end campaign. Those are not fun to do as level one. We won't, if we do like one-offs, they won't be level one, I guarantee you. Level one one-offs are the worst, unless you're teaching someone. Um, and all that jazz. I hear. I hear a cricket. Where are you? Maybe crickets are not catchable. But they, it definitely has a direction it's coming from. You can bug. Alright, let's dig up these trees. Eat a couple more oranges. I'm assuming that's what that one of ten means. Yeah, that's cool. Squish bug. Got him. The only reason I stopped my campaign demon is because I could spend two to three hours a week pretending. Yeah, yeah, I hear that. That's another rough thing. I do wish the campaign began at level three at least, though. Yeah, unfortunately, a couple of the ideas I have, um, they would be too strong. Especially if we have, like, six people playing. Uh, the characters would be too strong. Sweet, dig that up. But uh, I know how boring it is to play level one. You literally, it's beat people with stick, right? So, um, I know uh, no one wants to play that long. So essentially it'd be like first encounter, you're leveled up. It's like, I'd, I'd want to burn through it as fast as possible as well, man. <laughs> so don't you worry. It is not fun to stick on level one for very long. No, god damn it. Maybe I should just do it this way. That way she doesn't fill it in. Building us a nice little grove. I wonder how close they can be grown together. Because this feels... I do hear a present. Where is it? Probably up there. It is. Fun. You don't have to wait for it. What did I finish? Fruit roots. Yay. How did I skip the first one? Oh, those are the fruit trees. Okay. Those were not the dates. Dates. Got to keep an eye open on that. All right, it's here. Oops. Pop. Nope. Pop. You fucking piece of shit. Well, now, damn it. All right. Now I gotta hop across. Hurry up. Come down here. Carte Blanche. I'll have to look that up. If you're doing. Hold on. An error occurred. Service unavailable. Why can't I open that? No. Oh, I did the wrong thing. There you go. All right, now I'm going to go kill this thing while that's opening. Got it. Carte Blanche! Full discretionary... God damn it. Full discretionary power. Oh. Okay. Thank you, Yuri. I learned a thing. 
freaking really obs open in the other monitor that's fun there we go my pockets are full god damn it i have a bunch of weeds there we go we'll pick those up on the way back Whee! all right can i do a mass plant that'd be kind of cool like no nope. nope can't do that <laughs> you literally have to be looking at it oh yeah these ones you might need a space between the rows all right so let's fix that so we'll back against the wall here tree rather turn around there we go all right now i should be able to do it right yes okay I'm gonna plant a bunch of little orange trees So it looks like there's a bunch of uh, other fruit then besides oranges and pears or peaches. Tempo, what are you doing? What are you snacking on? Weird me out, dog. That one was too far. No, it wasn't. It's just the little baby trees don't take up much room. not full nice all right let's put this guy back down there we go now we got a little bit more room might expand this out a little bit more <laughs> I'm sure this is very riveting, guys. I apologize. You're doing one-off? Never level one. I yeah, you never do one-offs at level one. It's boring as hell. I guess it's really up to uh, what everyone's feeling. Because you're open for story? Yeah, there'll be... We'll have some levels up, but if people are just wanting to, you know, occasionally play some D&D, &D, throw a, a little mini campaign at us, cool, everyone create, you know, level five characters or something. Or you can hop over, damn it. I got all excited and I tried to hop over it. I feel like I'm playing uh, Farmville right now planting a bunch of oranges look at all these oranges we got this is awesome one two three four five six got 18 orange plants right here trees 18 times three that's a lot of oranges i think Fruit sells for a lot of money, too, so I'm okay with that. Give you this furniture for my presents, but I haven't expanded my house. Oh, yeah, how do I do that? What I meant by the former is I try not to break the game, but I try to go by backstory. Oh, I got you. My monk I sent you. His future fiance was killed, and I, it led to his solitary life. Where's the ring got for a necklace which cannot be removed? Yeah, man. I'm okay with that kind of background. That that stuff is better for uh, non-one-offs, of course. One-offs are just bit like, yo, there was a freaking person. They put out a bounty and y'all kind of grouped up, you know? Backstory uh, gives motivation for not only RP, but people interested in uh, continue playing. So it's really open to how everyone wants. All right, 
Let me go drop off this stuff, Crimson, then you're gonna have to tell me how to do this thing. Um... I need to sell things. Look at our friend over there fishing. I forgot his name. I did it, Mongo Face. Hello. I want to sell. Oh, I have 20 grand? That's actually kind of great. Because that's sitting at a... I don't know how fast trees grow. Um... That means we're already getting close to... Or a little over a fifth of the way paying off our home debt. Uh, oh wait, talk to you. About building a shop. Oh! Right now we're asking residents for help in donating the materials we need to build a shop. I'd like to donate! I'll oh, make a donation. Thank you so much for helping us. Right now you have some soft wood, wood and hardwood. Do you want to donate 30 of each? These are for you! Thank you so much. We only need one last bit to reach our donation goals for building the shop. If they can be in the me off, you are killed. A humidifier and a pink painted wood wall. What? I got a kilt, guys. Can I wear over my Teletubby onesie? We'd love your cooperation donating the last type of material we need. Heck yeah. All right. But really helps this character. Yeah, that, and that's something I, I really like. I think makes games far more interesting is when people have that kind of stuff, it helps them build their character, you know? It's a difficulty is though, for starting like that, it's like, all right, well, what, what's the reason you all came together? But it may just tur turn into something like that, where you're all level one, you're all kind of mercs, I guess. Whatever, you're just looking for some coin. I have to give you them tomorrow. If you visit my island after you visit, we'll become be- Oh, okay, so don't come visit you right now? The Nook phone. Oh, that's funny. Because I used to have to keep track of dozen voices. Yeah. Fortunately, I have this little dumb voice thing here. But uh, I will definitely have to create some profiles to uh, remember voices. And that's the thing, too, is like if you if I if you have voices and you have a continuing campaign, you definitely need. I need a different bed. You definitely need um. If you have a continual campaign, you definitely need to remember that kind of stuff. Okay. This is a little desk, so... Do I want to put this in the corner? Move, lamp. Everything in the way. I can't pull it? What? Fine. No, not that. Ooh, double sofa all the way. This, I might put this stupid thing. Let's do, uh, where'd that go? No. Oh, I didn't think I would be able to turn it off. It was up there. Um, this, we're gonna push. Oh, I definitely need some better wallpaper. Can I put this on the windowsill? That'd be kind of cool. Pink painted. Oh, place on wall. Okay, good enough. Hell yeah, look at my kilt. <laughs> Hang on wall, sure. What do you mean? Oh, guys, we're going... We're going full furry right now. Come on. No. Place on wall. 
really yes. want. Yes. <laughs> uh, I want a better bed. This thing is awful. Flashy flower, flower sign. What is this? Don't know. Uh, double sofa. All right, pick this up. That's going to go here. There we go. Pick up the switch. I'll go over here. Actually, wait. Wait, wait. Oh. This is sad. This is what we're going to do. We're going to use that. Wait. Can't I build a thing? I wish these actually had images. I can build a table, right? I thought I got a table thing. Let's see. Let's craft. Hold on. Yes, motivations, exactly. Uh, let's see. I'm on my alien so you can come visit. Oh, okay, I'll do that real quick. My favorite is still the pickle vendor. The hardest thing in D&D I've ever done is to actually man actually voice a mentally handicapped half orc pickle vendor. I think you told me about that. He was a cool dude. Yeah, you were telling me your characters absolutely loved him. Oh, it was a mirror. That's not what I wanted. I thought I had it. I do. That's what I want. Wood. Yeah. Mini table might come in handy. All right. I really want a bird thing. I don't, oh, I need one soft wood. That's lame. Um. Fuck it. If the campaign didn't collapse, I was going to co commission t-shirts. Nice. Keep crafting. Oh, all done. I really need a bed. Okay. This can go... Here. That's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Oh, that's why. There we go. This will have the... Humidifier. Okay. Someone's going to get rained on. <laughs> Alright, where's that? Basic teacher's desk. Oh wait, I gotta do this first. There we go. I mean... I guess it works. No! No, stop. There we go. <laughs> It'll work. Nintendo Switch. Not <sighs> Rotate the switch. God damn it. Ah, oh, this is annoying. Grab the fucking thing, mate. Jeez. Ugh. There we go. No, uh. It's so annoying. There we go. Okay, 
right, now place the stupid switch. Okay. Now. Fuck! I hate it. Why? <sighs> the movement. Moving things in this game sucks. You have to... The way you're gonna push or pull, you have to be on that edge. Otherwise, you're... Spinning it. It should be a an alter button. Like, you can push a, a button to say, Yo, I want to spin now. Uh, someone's gonna have a sad cardboard box. <laughs> this is looking great. You want to put a mirror there? Nailed it. <laughs> this looks awful. And, uh, this is... This is, uh... No, not that. We're gonna have some mood lighting. Right here. Nailed it. What was the other one? Flashy flower, flower sign. This, I don't care. <laughs> Fine, put those in storage. Put those in storage. I need to know what this flower sign is. He's one of your favorite NPCs. Yeah, I love having uh, NPCs that people just kind of end up loving. All right. Flashy flower sign, please. What? Yay. Oh, no. Make sure to go fishing. I have new fish as well as bugs, mostly in moths that keeps appearing. This moth doesn't leave the uh, the nook area. All right, how do I get to you? DIY furniture. I did a thing. Sweet. I have room. Okay. I think I go bug down here. And, uh, he said I talked to the the guy in here. Look at this guy. Look, Nook is everywhere. I thought that was a baby crib. My stupid brain. What are these? Postcards? If you want to use our postal service, you gotta come over here and hear the whole rigmarole. Alright. Hey, welcome to the one of the gateway of the skies, the Cocktail Airport. Nice to meet you. I'm Orville. We have the crew for Dodo Airlines. Dodo Airlines, the crew may be flightless. But that doesn't mean you have to be. If you want to visit another island, invite friends to this one, or go on a mystery tour, this is the place to be. Oh. We also got mail service at this airport. Sometimes the letter is just better, you know? Okay, watch the sense of what I don't think your cards are to your right. I got all kinds of cards at the card stand. By the way, you got my right? It's a small island. Word gets around. You just got a Nook Miles ticket from Tom Nook with Vase written on it, which makes it yours. So if you want to use this ticket, you gotta say the magic words. I want to fly. Got it? So, Vase, you got anything to tell me? I want to fly! Roger! By the way, I got a Nook Miles ticket with your name on behind the desk here, so use that whenever. So, just get the paperwork official. Where did you want to go? Uh... What's the difference? Isn't this the same thing? Ah, so you want to go visit somebody on another island! But the first thing you can with folks on another island with letters and... In or visiting him. The legal legal say I gotta make sure you see some important info. 
It's kind of long. Big deal. So please read the whole thing. Uh, during local and online play, other players you play with can see player generated text and graphics as such as, as names, chat, bulletin board posts, the look of the entire island, rooms and homes, custom designs, and other content. Please be mindful of the content you share with others as enjoy as you enjoy communicating with them. Like just thinking you through the yard fest there. Let's move on to the next step. Well, over to the nearby island, a local player, some far off island, an online play. Online play. Sounds good. Oh, but sorry, we showed you this before, but the legal eagles say we got to. Eagles say we got to before someone plays online. Be considerate. Please do not share illegal content, personal information, content that infringes on the rights of others, or content that irritates others. Please don't cheat or behave in a way that would irritate other players. The Nintendo Code of Contact applies in in-game behavior and any shared content. If your content or behavior is deemed to violate the Nintendo Code of Contact, action can be taken, including deleting content from the server or restricting access to play online. You can press blah to report inappropriate behavior. Please be mindful of the Nintendo Code of Contact and be considerate to other players. Gotcha. Gotcha. Let me connect you to the old internet for some all I play then. Roger. Look at my- I have pink socks, I didn't know that. Coming into the campaign. Oh yeah. How do you want to travel? Let's search for a friend. Is it search for a friend? I'm assuming. Oh hey, first time playing with friends? I have an for you. It's called the best friends list and I can honestly tell you without exaggeration. It's the best thing ever. It just takes a second to install, so can you pull out your phone for me? Here you go. What were you? Best friends list. Neat. And you're all set. The obstacle and instructions built in, so just open it up to meet up with a friend. Looking for islands you can visit. Look at him sweating out. Oh, hey, God, which island did you want to go to? Hey, look, Voltius. Are you Kayla? Paupu Island. Let's go to Paupu Island. Okay, I'm ready to depart. Oh, what is that? You're all set? If only you need travel, just think. What would dodos do? Dodos are extinct, so... Probably wouldn't want to do that. Although, I guess it wasn't their fault. Look! This is clever. We're going to visit Crimson. You can use voice chat. My phone. Take care of your seat in upright positions. Looking tired is 9 p.m. We got clear skies and the temperature is comfortable. Hey, look it! That's adorable! We'll be making water landing, but that's okay because this is. I don't know what he said at the end there. Chat with other players. Press R to send messages to everyone you're playing with. You can also use the chat log app, your new phone, to see past messages. I got zeal. I got things happening. It, like, visit another person. Island in your land. Uh. Yay, money. Is that you, Crimson? You're adorable. Give me, let me give you a high five. I don't know how to give high fives. Uh, you have a little fox person. This is a very pretty tree. I can actually interact with your island? Are you serious? Look at your flowers. You have Sonic. You have Sonic on your island. Hello. Can I talk to Sonic? Hello, 
Here's the video. I've got all the clothes and accessories you could need. Oh, really? Great. Let me open up these catalog for you. <gasps> Something that's not garbage. Oh. I'm buying all these. I don't care. My outfit is horrendous. Thank you. Do I look at anything else? I do. Caterpillar costume. I need it because I have the frog costume. God damn it. I kind of like that jacket. <laughs> Yay. I got a frog costume. See this thing. All right. Wrong button. I need to put on these shoes. Heck yeah. Also, can't I do this again? Where? Yes! I don't like my... Oh, my outfit is still quite terrible, but it's acceptable. Look at all the stuff she has. Oh, this is an adorable house. Hey, you dropped some wood, Crimson. Oh, we got a, your residents have big old houses too. Got a clothesline. Whoa, there's bridges. That's awesome. Does that mean I can move like everyone away from me? A barbecue. Heck yeah. Here's some clay. I can actually pick stuff up. Okay. <gasps> there's a cherry tree. I need the cherries. Hold on a minute. I need these cherries. Whee! Cherry tree. All right, don't attack me. <gasps> and pears? Crimson. My game locked up for a second. If, if bees were in there, I was going to get screwed. Crimson, I'm taking some of your stuff, if that's okay. Look at all these trees. Got some more cherries. Oh, what a cool island. Oops, wrong button. Uh, this button. Oh, you dropped something? Uh oh. Where'd you drop it? Oh, these things. Oh. Blue Argyle rug. And a cloud flooring. Ooh, cloud flooring. It didn't tell me what that was. Imperial tile, sweet. Iron nuggets, sweet. Aw. Oh. You got a cool scooter. I will <laughs> I will trade you my pink scooter for that one if you want. Look at this island, guys. She's got palm trees. Whoa. Look at these things. Are these coconuts? These look like coconuts. There better not be any bees in a coconut tree. Oh, do these have to be pla planted on the... Oh, what is this? Do these have to be planted on sand? What was that? Hey, Crimson, I got an Aries fragment. Do you want it? What is it? What's an Aries fragment? Oh, is this the museum? That's cool. I don't want to go into any of these for... <gasps> Basketball. I don't want to spoil anything by going into any of these. But I got this weird fragment thing if you want it. I can keep it? Okay. Do the, the fruit just fall off? Do they just fall off trees naturally? As well? Oh, cool. You got little beach bed things. Uh, look at these shells. Are these something you sit on? How do I put my thing away? Oh, I thought I could sit on those. I can! Look at me! Ah! I need a picture. This is not my town, but I love it. Yay! You can sit on them. How do I get back off? There you go. Oh, a wasp was in this one. These are really pretty. How'd you get these trees? And how do you emote? I want to emote. Mm -hmm. 
I haven't learned to emo yet. What is that? These are eggs. You have eggs in your trees. Are these actually eggs? What is that? I don't need this. Wait, what did I... Leaf egg. What's a leaf egg? Ooh, look at the flowers. Look at all the cool stuff Crimson has. <gasps> I need to build one of those. Sold. Oh, did someone move out? I like your little island. Do you have different fish than me? I wonder if you have different fish. You do? Dang it. I should I didn't know I was gonna there's gonna be so much stuff here, I would have cleared out my inventory. It's cool that you can actually interact with people's areas. Although I wonder if you can act I thought okay. If you can interact with people's islands, could you actually steal all their stuff? Because that would be unfortunate. You know? If someone just... Although I guess you have to open up your island, right? Let me see. New fish? <gasps> I got an egg! I fished out an egg. Oh, look at me sidestepping. Oh, there was flower... There was bugs on those. Damn it. Are all your fish... Eggs right now? I want to see a different fish. I'm getting tired of my fish. Come on. Give it. Also. Fresh rider goby. Hey. <laughs> Didn't I have a quest for that? It doesn't count until I put it in my inventory, does it? A water egg. And a leaf egg. Okay. Uh. I hear you. You're prancing around. I gotta drop something. <gasps> What'd you do? I didn't see it. No. I need to drop something. Here. I have a million of those. Whoa, look at that butterfly! Thing's awesome. Is that like a rare butterfly? The thing was cool. Can you keep it? Like, put it in a jar? Damn it, I just did that. Oh, wait, we gotta, we gotta go take, take a picture. Let's go. Where's your favorite place? We gotta go take a picture. You lead. You are looking heckin' adorable. You little pink sweater or purple sweater also I need to put my stinking thing away you want right here <laughs> if I can <laughs> ah look at you being adorable come line up there you go all right wait Wait. I can't get it to just flip around. There we go. Oh, did it. All right. Now we can do pictures. All right. No. Ah, oh, I pushed the wrong button. I ruined it. There we go. Oh, all right. And it's this button to line it up. Look at us. We're adorable. Oh. Can't do that. Okay. Yeah. Look at. It's me and Crimson. Take photo. Yes! Uh-oh. Hopefully you weren't moving. 
I'll take another one just in case. Yes! I love it! <laughs> Alright, this game just got 20 times adorabler. Clownfish and... You have seahorses and clownfish? You have seahorses and clownfish? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I need to go release this... This goby. Here you go, friend. It doesn't show people on the map. I guess that's good, because I think some people were playing, like, hide-and-seek and stuff. Which is heckin' adorable. I like the, the foot sounds. You can have a giant party of people on your island. It's kind of cool. I kind of like how your island's set up. I like it better than mine. Catch the fish. Give me the fish. Huh. Maybe I only, um... Because I'm catching the fish that are on my island. wonder if that's a thing. Let's try it one more time. I got another egg. <laughs> I catch eggs or fish that are on my island. island. Oh, come to you for a fish? Where are you? Oh, there's a fish. Oh, I scared him. There's also zebra tur zebra turkey fish. Where are you? That's a great idea, putting that little campfire on the beach there. I might have to do that. Running scares them. I have no idea where you're at. There you are. Oh, you have a little hair thing, a little heart. I love it. Oh, there's one. Hi yeah! Just don't mess it up. Go away, bug. Give it, give it, give it. I got an egg. <laughs> How do I... Oh. Oh, buttons. Okay. Oh, another one? Alright, let's see. Hiya! I can't even see him. Oh. Right here. Yeah! Eggs. Do you see what I pull out like or do you not know what I get? So many eggs <laughs> Oops, oops, okay, okay. Sonic guy. Look at that. Oh, 
a sushi picnic. And mochi balls. And orange juice. And french fries. I like the clothesline. That's cute. This is cool. It's a sacrifice table. <laughs> what was that? Something just happened with this tree. And made a funny noise. No, that's not what I want. This tree made a weird noise. Oh. Look at all these fruits. So much fruit. Look at the wildflower area. Sweet. Look at that dual fish. Ooh, there's orange ones. You can pick the fruit too. And bring them back. Oh yeah, I picked a couple. Yeah, I got pear, coconut. I already had peach and cherry. So I can go add to my little grove. <gasps> Look at this adorable tree. It's a little baby version. Dude, there's a lot of flowers in this game. I was excited with just my flowers, but... Look at this thing floating. I can catch that? This cherry blossom petal is so lovely. Pink is really its color. I just caught a cherry blossom feather. Or thing. What do I do with that? <laughs> I can't plant that, right? Can I plant that? It'd be kind of cool. All right, what time is it? Holy crap, it's 1030. My time is wrong in my game. <laughs> it's an hour behind. I thought I, I was like, I'm gonna interact with that? Does that show? That would be really cool if it showed like actual clothing on there. Oh, we're going inside. Nope. Oh, wait. Knock, knock. Okay, it just took a while. <gasps> Excuse me. You can talk to the frog villager in Blue House. Look at this guy! I love him. I will see you before you see this movie here. Hey, Blue here. Oh, your face is right where you're visiting. I'm Jeremiah. Oh, Blue Island is the best knee deep. So enjoy your time here. I like the frog person. Oh, I want the frog person. He's got an orange stool. What is this symbol? Oh, that's something getting built. I'm assuming this pink one is yours then, bros. Because the, all the other ones are yellow. Is that the case? Knock, knock. I really need to change my socks. Hey, it's Cherry. I have you. Hi, how are you? Post up in front town. I did the wrong voice. Post up in front town. No, you've never been. I'm just gonna turn on the street. Someone talking about you. I'm sorry. You like me? You gotta stay off Papua Island more than every day. I'm here. Anyway, I'll stop where you are. Come back again sometime. She. That was weird. That was a funky interaction. Come check out your house. All right, hold on. Am I right? Yours is the the colored one on the map. All the ones I have are yellow and then one pink one. Whoa, is that a lion? Hey, you're facing from off island, right? My name is Mott. Nice to meet you. I didn't bring you myself, so my tour guide muscles aren't quite there yet, KG. 
Why does everyone have nicknames? So awesome she visitors. I just love how popular this place is. His name is Mott. And he's wearing a captain's sweater. Oh, there's a big structure in the background. Oh, it's a basketball hoop. It looks huge. Look at this adorable little house. Knock, knock. Can you use the telescope? That'd be sweet. Oh my gosh, look at all your animals. That's a cool praying mantis. Whoa, that's a huge butterfly. Look at the little Nemo. Oh, you got a fan up there? Nice. I love your house. Oh, you got a cooler humidifier. There's different kinds. Oh, I like that little planter in the corner. And you got a little lava lamp. Ah, look at me jump. <laughs> you have water in your in your house. Whoa, how'd you do that? Is that a floorboard pattern? That clock is adorable. Oops. I didn't know I could do that. Splish splash. I like they gave him a little anemone. This is adorable. You can move the camera? Oh, cool. That's cool little ear plant in there. What are they fish? Little baby seahorses. Oh, there's the sea butterfly. Lionfish. Ooh, look at the butterfly over there. The blue one. I just caught one of those. This is awesome. Does that mirror actually work? No. I like the splashies. <laughs> these are cute. I like these flowers. You're excited for so many fish and bugs. <laughs> yeah, you have a collection. Can you get bigger houses? Because that'd be cool to have like a giant like side room of just animals. The giant moth, this one? Yeah, this thing's huge. It's like he can't fit in his container. Oops, backwards. That's the one that you uh, showed me outside, wasn't it? He's huge. So, is it the longer you play, the more rare stuff? A ladybug! The more rare stuff that you can find? Or is it just all odds all together? Oops. I like your little decor. Heck, there's a lot to this game. Holy crap. Stretch them. What is it? Oh. <laughs> the little ZL thing in my top. I looked over at my stream and I thought there was something on my stream. Chat log. What's this? You can use this app to review conversations you've had with other players anywhere, anytime. Maybe you didn't get a chance to read something someone said while you were playing together. Or maybe you want to reread a message to some best friend who lives far away. Sounds like some convenient, right? Oh, neat. What's this? Best friends list. You can use this app to check which friends your best friends are playing with. When your best friends with another player, you can tell when they are playing online. Oh, that's cool. If both of you are online, you can use the internet to send direct messages to each other. Super cool. If you do not want others to know you're online or if you do not want to exchange messages, press blah to enable or disable this feature. As to be best friends. Yay. What are these other things? Oh, that's my critters. I really need to change my outfit. <laughs> it's, it's an eyesore. I want a slam dunk. I need a basketball. All right, how do I... It has a light. Bonk. Maybe I should put mine outside. Bonk. Look at me sneaking. Hmm.
All right. I think I need to go to bed, though. Found another, another fish. All right, let's try to fish this one. Wait, do I have any room? I don't have any room for a fish. I could drop these. All right, let's go try this one last fish. Yeah. Another egg. <laughs> so can you visit people's islands if they're offline? Or do you have to like open up your island? You know? What would you like to do? Oh, I can view your passport. Look at, oh my gosh, Crimson, you're adorable. A little happy face. Uh, return to my island. We're getting ready to return home. Yeah, through local or online. Oh, okay. I thought people would have to be online. All right, clear skies ahead. I don't remember uh, his voice. Are they gonna do their dance again? No. Got a hangnail. Well, I'll have to plant all those trees and stuff tomorrow. I kind of want to plant them today. Just so just... Oh, wait. This is your captain's baby. We need to see all rappers to make sure you see those are securely fashioned. Local time is 10.30 p.m. We've got clear skies and the temperature is comfortable. Oh! Well, let me need one landing, but that's okay because it's a seaplane. Um... So my time was right, but it was, was that for your time zone? That's super cool. I have so many messages. Holy crap. Hang now. I got, I got miles for flying. Guess what? I made some friends. Uh... What was I gonna do? I don't even remember. I remember. Eh, I'll do it later because I'm 30 minutes over time here. But uh, that was fun. Uh, I hope you guys had fun. Um, thank you, Crimson, for letting me visit your island. It was adorable. I love your avatar. Uh, I think she fits you very well. Um, but, my dear friends, thank you guys so much for tuning in with me. I hope you guys liked it. If you did remember to like subscribe comment it helps me out a lot let me know what you're liking what you're not liking let me um switch this off real quick and uh maybe maybe we'll see if uh, any friends are online and maybe we'll go throw them some love because you know that's a good thing to do go show some friends some love yeah, maybe it's um i kind of like the uh the visiting thing might have to do that uh, get some more friends and join in on their little islands and stuff. Sounds fun to me. Let's see. Um, there's another place I'm playing uh, Animal Crossing. Yeah, let's go raid this person. Wait, let me see. Yeah, we'll go raid them. They seem, they seem cool. Um, so get your raid messages out and ready. And, or ready. Uh, out and ready. Uh, we'll go for a raid real quick. And uh, if you stick, along, stick around for the raid, you get channel points as well. So I encourage that. Um, but I appreciate you guys hanging out and playing with me. Thank you, Crimson, for allowing me to uh, hang out with you in your little island for a little bit. Uh, that was adorable. But uh, thank you guys for hanging out with me. Uh, remember to spay new to your pets, adopt, don't shop, donate to rescue if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. It is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out that are very much in need. Anyway, I'm Invasive. Doggies are down here. That one's a Jada. This one's a Mamas. Thank you guys so much for tuning with me, and I'll catch you guys next time. See ya.
Thank you so much for the free. What's up? Hello. <laughs> I don't know if that was delayed because I saw the number, but then I didn't see the thing. But thanks. I'm good, I'm good. How are you? How is everyone? Welcome. We're quite chillin' tonight. It's a chill Wednesday. 